Hey guys, I'm back with another channel message. This is Sabrina, your elite empress. Go ahead and like this video, okay? Thank you for subscribing to me if you're new. Um, go ahead and check out my description box, okay? Hmm. So, Spirit wanted me to warn you guys. Um, there. Okay, so there's some new people on here. Some of you guys um maybe going through yeah wow i just flipped this card over so they wanted me to talk about the new initiates or somebody has been initiated into some sort of secret society okay i feel like this is new this is a a, a secret society that is trying to initiate you or this could be some sort of cult group coven this could even be a church right um i got confirmation actually um of this from a client that actually texted me because I had um did a reading a while back about how um there was someone that was trying to get her to go to their person that does readings for them right and um I told her I said no that girl is just trying to um basically get you to go to that reader so that you wouldn't know the truth because um 120 yeah um I feel like Okay, and the thing is, she had gone to a church. She was trying to get her to go to her church. And she was also trying to get her to go to her reader. So these are people in the church. These are people in, um, they're in the church, but they're really spiritual. They still, they go to church, but they get readings and stuff, right? Or these are, like I said, it could be a cult group, a Sikh society. But they're 144. Yeah. This has to do with um, secret societies that are hit, that are in religious groups. These are religions. Um, hmm. so you could have been newly initiated into some sort of group where they're trying to initiate you, right? But they're treating it, you're treating you, okay, this could be a divine masculine or divine feminine, but I was definitely getting divine masculine energy heavy. They're treating you like, uh, a, a, they wanted me to say like, it's like, uh, you know how you get, um, this could be a gang as well, you guys, but you know how, um, Okay, or someone in the music industry. This could definitely be music industry. They're trying to make you do fucked up shit or really weird shit. Like they're okay. So this could also be like um, if you guys know like you know, um, Santeria as well. So they're trying to get you to pay a lot of money. Um, they're trying to get you to. What these groups do is they, they like kind of try to mimic, the initiations. The spiritual initiations that we really have to go to because you could be initiated into some sort of group or all you fucking want but the real initiations happen in the spirit okay so spirit wants me to tell you guys that be careful with these groups okay the best thing that you could do is talk to spirit um and listen to the the synchronicities okay the angel numbers that you're getting listen to the divine guidance that you're being that you're receiving okay the telepathy a lot of you guys could be um telepathic and you're hearing the thoughts of these people these people are treating you like some sort of water boy like it's like um like the on the nfl team or some shit you want to make it to the nfl team but they're trying to say that you got to be a water boy first or you're gonna be you're, you're trying to be initiated to some sort of game but they're trying to fucking say that you got to do all this stupid dumb shit first you don't got to do none of that shit your real family is trying to initiate you your royal family okay this is a royal family reading. Your real royal family is initiating you in the spirit. You don't got to be a part of none of this shit that they're trying to do. None of that shit. So if you're kind of new to spirituality, you could be trying to learn more. And that's why these people are um, trying to get to you before you have a little bit more information. It's also just um, for you to learn, okay? Because a lot of times when you're going through initiation... Um, people attack you, people um, people gangstalk you because they try to kill off the initiates, okay? Um, hmm. I wrote down some notes about this. So they're trying to kill off the initiates, the neophytes, okay? Let's see. I was watching this show. It's called The Order. It's kind of like that. If you guys watch The Order, a lot of you guys, it's like you're trying to be initiated into um, some sort of group, right? Some sort of order. 
but you're really you're real you're really supposed to be like Like you guys could be a part of a, the Egyptian. Um, that could be a, you have Egyptian blood, and your royal family is trying to initiate you. They don't want you to be a part of this fucking bullshit. Yeah, a lot of you guys are natural witches. You're natural, naturally. You have natural abilities, natural supernatural abilities. Okay, you don't have to. Um, you don't. You don't need anyone else to initiate you. You might. You might go through some sort of apprenticeship. But like let's say, like someone like me, like um, let's say you learn from someone. It could be someone on YouTube, a spiritual teacher, a spiritual leader, someone with integrity, someone that you know actually follows the spiritual laws, the universal laws. Um, they have good integrity, good, good moral value, okay? Um, not necessarily religious, like I said. Um, but you have to see, like, then you're going to know if, if this is a false, like, religious group because they're going to lack integrity. So, for example, the client that I, that I told you texted me, she gave me confirmation because she told me that. So there was these people, they was trying to get her to come to the church, right? And they was also trying to get her to get a new reader because she has said that she got a reading. I told her, I said, don't do that no more. It's four or four on the clock. I said, don't do that no more. Don't tell people you're getting a reading. None of that shit. Because these people are trying to hide evidence of the things that they're doing against you. So they're trying to manipulate you. Um, it could be like they're trying to, you know, get you to go to readers that are um, false, false uh, karmic readers, okay? Um, they're trying to get you to go to church with them, right? So she texted me and she was like, hold on. She was like that the girl... She used to work with the girl. She said that the girl came to her job. And this is this is like months later. She didn't find this out until months later. But she knew already because I had told her. Um, but she said that the girl came to her job and she cursed out. This is her friend. Her, she stopped being friends with one of the girls that worked for her. Because um, they was trying to say that they do she do magic on them and stuff like that. And it was all because that's what they were doing. They were projecting onto her what they were doing. So they were saying that, oh... That she shouldn't be getting readings. She shouldn't be letting people tap into her energy and stuff. Meanwhile, they referred her to another reader. You you see what I'm saying? Like, what? You trying to get her to go to your, your reader. But you're trying to say, oh, she shouldn't be getting anybody to tap into her energy. What kind of backwards ass bitch is you? What, what, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? So it's all because they was a part of some sort of group, right? And they was trying to get her to join. So months later, fast forward months later... What, the girl that she stopped being friends with because the other girl turned her against her trying to say that she's doing like and she's calling me right now and how ironic is that and i just saw 818 she's calling me right now so um she she was trying to say that um basically the girl came to her job and accused her right in front of everybody like bitch what are you doing to me you're doing magic on me i know you're doing magic on me and that's the leader of the coven group that she has said that and she exposed her in front of everybody. And she had left that job. Um, but she the, she still knew people that worked there. And they told her. And she, and it was crazy because they was all like acting funny towards her. And they was all treating her bad because of the other girls. Yeah, work snitch. So it could be a work snitch situation. Or this could also be a job. This, this job has people that's in the secret society trying to initiate you. And they're like hiding this. Okay, so they're trying to get you to like um go to like yeah they're trying to get, get this would also be like a, a like a, I got this energy too a couple of readings ago it's supposed to be like a I don't know why I'm getting like yoga yoga group exercise group gang church. Assassin. Yeah, these are people that they could try to turn against you. Okay, assassinate your character. Um, this is a part of their initiation. So they could be trying to say that you have to kill someone to be initiated. If this is like, um, this could be like spiritually. Um, if this is like a gang, 
this could be physically like you know that's what they do they try to say that you have to do all this evil shit to get initiated into this game right and this is gonna see somebody here works in an office these people in this office are trying to defame your character these people are trying to snitch on you they're doing all types of fucked up shit because they want you to join them right they're trying to assassinate your character and they're stalking you these people are a part of some sort of corrupt thing that they're doing i don't know they're doing some sort of illegal shit okay um they're doing some sort of illegal shit tracking you um they got hidden they got cameras in the in the um office and i feel like the the um the police is like looking at the shit that they're doing they're trying to look into this office what, what's going on in this office this, this could be a doctor's office i just said that and look this could be a doctor's office Yeah, the, the client that I had, she worked in a doctor's office, a practice. So this could be a doctor's office. Yeah, they're trying to initiate you into something or whatever. Identity theft. They're doing some sort of identity theft. You're, they're scamming in there. They're doing all types of, all types of identity theft. Okay. And they're, they're, there's a comic reader involved. There's somebody here reading, reading people. And this person has mental problems. Okay, this person has like the energy of like suicide. Because they're tapping into energies that sh they shouldn't be tapping into. Okay, they can have some sort of um, succubus entity attached to them. Okay, because they have not healed that energy in themselves. There's some sort of energy in themselves that they haven't healed. So when you when you when you go to a reader, you need to you know look into them, see what they do. Like if they're really about that life, like if they really have integrity. Because a lot of these readers. They be reading, they be, they be, you know, picking up these cards, man. And they don't be healing themselves from their childhood wounds, you know. It's not like a one, two, three thing, but you constantly working and healing yourself, you know. Um, and you live by what you say, okay. And you're not over here just doing shit for money because a lot of these fucking readers are doing shit for money. They're not doing shit, you know, or they're doing shit because they, they um, want some sort of power over you. Yeah. Some of you guys, they're really trying to, like, they could be really trying to kill you. I'm not going to lie. Because you don't want to join them, so they want, they, they're they getting one of their initiates to try to kill you. These people could be getting some sort of, like, um things in your name, okay? They could have used your identity. This could be, like, a corrupt-ass office, a doctor's office that you work for they could have like you know did a, if they did like background checks and stuff on you of course they have your information they could they're they're making fake accounts in people's names and they're under investigation for this okay this doctor is like um hiding this evidence but there's somebody that's snitching on them i'm also getting like there's people that's snitching um there's like a work snitch they're trying to snitch on you but they're saying lies to this doctor COVID-19 yeah this could be definitely someone that um works in a doctor's office okay they test people for COVID-19 all that yeah so they're trying to snitch on you they got work snitches that snitching on you to this doctor trying to get you fired and stuff or trying to say corrupt stuff because you don't want to join them really they just want you out of there because you don't want to do what they do you don't want to be involved in the identity theft shit scheme um, and you're going to get pulled out of this job or you're going to get fired or something's going to happen where you can't go to work no more. You might catch COVID-19, okay, or you might have caught COVID-19, 411, because you got the 411, okay? You got the, you already know, yeah, 14 on, on the clock. You already know you got pulled out that job because these people are about to get busted, okay? You don't want to be a part of that. You're not a part of it. So, yeah, you're protected. All right, love y'all. Okay, so I get it now. So, basically, this could be somebody... That, that works at a doctor's office could either be exposed for um you know how they they sell in those fake vaccine cards like they're saying that you got the shot but you don't really have the shot you just paid for a vaccine card so, somebody is selling those out the doctor's office they probably get caught up they under investigation somebody that's selling those or this is a whole practice that's about to go down for this this could also be um they're saying that people got covid and they don't or they're saying that people don't got covid and they really do okay so yeah, that's what they wanted me to tell you guys. But I love y'all. So if you like this video, go ahead and like it and check out my description box, okay, for all of my services. I have Insta, I got TikTok, I got all that. So add me on those, okay? Love y'all.